Hey Minecrafters, welcome back to the channel, or to the channel if you're new here, and to episode 23 of my Better Minecraft Mod Pack series. Now this is going to be the final episode, but I still have a couple things that I would like to do and we're going to bring a few friends along for the ride with us. So grab a drink, grab a snack, whatever it is that you get for while you watch videos, and let's get on with the fun. Alrighty, so um, a couple of things before we start. You might hear fireworks outside, it is Victoria Day weekend, so it's a little bit loud. The window's shut, so it should muffle it, but if not, that's what that sound is. I pre-apologize. Um, and uh, a couple of other things, actually. So Mr. Editor was going to join us for this episode, but unfortunately, uh, uh, LAN, or LAN, or whatever you want to call it, it uh, isn't very stable, at least with, not with this version of Better Minecraft. Sure. In um, the little hi, hi, <laughs> in the little mini series that he and I did, uh, it was working pretty well. But it, it definitely isn't a risk we're going to take for this one because if you even open the land option here, it gives you a warning and stuff. So um, we're not going to attempt that. So unfortunately, he's not going to join, but he will once we get a server going up. So um, or when we have a server up. Now uh, there are a couple of other things that I did do. I did. <laughs> This little guy um, I did add the mythic mounts mod for this uh, this episode specifically and also a mod that Kyle thank you by the way Kyle had given me to make sure that you don't damage your your mounts or your pets which is awesome because I don't want to end up you know damaging my animals during during any fights or anything like that so um, thank you again Kyle that's really really helpful so I have added that in here so we have some battle friends that we're gonna take we have four griffins four dire wolves four zarp tax and four essentias or akensha I still don't know how to say it um, because we are going to be doing the aviary which is the dungeon that I had mentioned I would like to do on the last uh, episode of the series which is what this is this is the last episode um, and I would like to touch on the fact that the series was kind of short in a series sense it was 23 episodes you know about a half a year almost or give or take no, my math isn't that great but <laughs> um it was a good starter series to kind of get my channel in the groove of making series and, and me getting comfortable and learning the things that i do and don't want to do while doing series so it wasn't as long as you know some of my other other series are going to be but it is definitely a learning experience so thank you for coming along on this ride with me it, it was just so much fun to do and just seeing all the comments and the channel growth during the series and all the input from you guys oh my gosh it, it's just the beginning but it's still it will still hold a huge place in my heart because this was the first big official series on the channel so thank you for being a part of it it really really means the world to me so um yeah that's that's the update and like i said i have these mounts obviously i gave myself these mounts i tamed them i, I put some dragon armor on them because i wasn't going to go out and spend all the time to go find them just to you know go battle with them because this is that's not what this episode is. this is just us going to the aviary to have fun and they're replacing mr editor because he couldn't be here so <laughs> Um, and I have turned keep inventory on, which it wasn't on for the whole series. I have turned it on because if I do die, which I probably will, um, I don't want to be spending, you know, 30 minutes getting my stuff back because that's just going to cut into recording time. So, um, yeah, hopefully that's not too, like, quote unquote, cheaty for you guys. But whatever, it, that, that's not the basis of the video. The basis of the video is to go and have fun with the, you know, the, the dungeon. So... Yeah, that's what we're going to do, and I'm excited, and I'm ready for it, because I have been looking forward to doing this dungeon for so long. Uh, the last thing is, there is a poll on the community tab for the next series, which um, I was thinking of doing prominence, which I have spoken about before, but because it is so similar to... <laughs> this guy is a giggle. It's so similar to Medieval Minecraft and Better Minecraft, I think we're going to do a different one just to kind of like wet the palette a little bit and kind of, you know, change it up. So I was thinking of doing FTB Skies. So I put a poll there um, if you guys would rather see FTB Skies, which is in 1.19, um, or do something like Prominence, which again is very similar to these two. So it's whatever you guys want to see as well, because obviously this is for you. So you guys let me know. I'm going to leave it up for a few more days. Give me your input on there. And that doesn't mean any of the other packs you guys have suggested or anything like that have been put to the wayside. There is a list I have of, of packs we're going to play. I'm doing this for a very, very, very long time, as long as humanly possible. So lots of packs that we, there's lots of packs that we can do and go through. So don't worry. They're all on the list. I promise. I'm just trying to like mix it up. So like we're not doing the same kind of content over and over and over again, which, you know, better Minecraft and medieval Minecraft were already pretty similar in some senses. But I'm going to stop babbling. We're going to go do a, a dungeon. I swear. I just wanted to get all of that out so you guys know what's going on and what the updates were. So 
I'm gonna miss you little dudes, but I'll see you in medieval Minecraft, okay? Just not as frequently, because I turned you up way too high in this pack. Mm. Yeah, exactly. Well, I'll miss you. Anyways, um, we'll definitely have to name some turtles in the other pack too, but uh, I'm gonna keep this world and come and explore it and play on it every now and then, I'm sure. So he's just following me. I don't have anything for you, little dude. I got nothing. So I put some platforms over where the dungeons are. Uh, I keep saying dungeons because I did mar I did uh, put a platform at a secondary one, which is one of the flyers. Um, if we have time to do that one, we'll do that one. But we're definitely going to concentrate on the aviary today. Because that is the one that I really, really, really want to do. So, uh, yeah, we're going to go over there. Let's see. I got my fire resistance. I don't know if I'm going to need it. I have it anyways. Golden apples, hamburgers, all my, my weapons. I did end up putting backstabbing and potent poison on my sword. I got some villagers for that. So that's... Super duper handy. Um, I got some thorns for my gear because who knows? I need all the extra help that I can get in this place. It is crazy. So <laughs> I would bother check. I, I would check your trades, but I don't need them anymore, man. <laughs> well, yeah, let's go over there. We've got our animals. Um, I don't know if I'm going to get them all out. I do have the flyers for the phantoms and stuff that are going to be there. So I don't know if they're still giant phantoms or not, but we are going to see. Oh gosh, did it not save again? Uh, is this the one? Which one is this? Okay, this is the aviary, okay. Oh man, look at the size of this thing. It's so big. <laughs> it's so pretty though, look at that. It looks like a flower. And this, you can see the little platforms that I made. There's a platform here that I made and a platform over there. So these are the two that I marked, but uh, yeah. Pretty crazy. Okie doke. So I'm just gonna break this open a little bit. Hopefully they don't catch wind of me yet. I see them over there, those big stinkies. So, okay. Oh, we got our zombies too. I don't know if I mentioned that, but uh, yeah. So let's get one griffin out just to test this. Griffin, a dire wolf, a zarptak, and an essentia or kensha. I still, I really don't know how to say it. So. Oh, they're still laying down. Um, I don't have a stick. Oh my god. I'm <laughs> you'd think I'd be prepared for this, but I am not. Okay, so let's put this here. Let's grab a stick. So they can be following us. Following, okay. Following. Look at them with their little dragon armor. Oh, they are so precious. Okay, uh, I can't tell what's empty and what's not for some reason. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, no. Look at the dire wolves. So we don't actually have a dire wolf on medieval Minecraft yet, but look at the size of them. Holy cow. I figured they'd be good for ground fighting. And of course we have our griffin. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Following. Following. Following, following. Okay. All right. Are we ready? Are we ready to do this? It's going to get crazy, my little dudes. Or big dudes or whatever. Giant dudes. Holy Let's test to make sure. Okay, so if I crouch, okay, so I'm gonna make sure I don't crouch. <laughs> okay, can these guys get out? Wait, why doesn't efficiency five or six work? Okay. All right, can you guys, are you guys? Whoa. Oh God, don't fall. No. Okay, let's go before you guys fall off the edge. Here we go. All right. Oh. Have I overprepared? Probably. Okay, so there are... Oh, I need rockets. Rockets. Rockets? I'm gonna put this guy away. I need to get up there. Oh, I should have blocks too. Oh my god, I am so underprepared. Okay, I should probably get some blocks. Um, let's use cobblestone. So I need to get these spawners. You guys better not try to follow me up here, I swear. Oh, you guys hear that dire wolf sound? Oh my god, they sound so cool. Oh, oh, I see a stinky. Oh. I see, oh my god, look at the size of them. I forgot how just how big they are. Look at, look at the size of him. Holy guacamole, that's so big. Look at the size of that phantom. Oh 
Okay, well, these aren't the guys I'm worried about. The phantoms are the easy part. Oh, there go the fireworks. These guys are just like, uh, do, do, you, do you need us for something? Why are you guys not fighting me? I still feel so bad about what I had to do. Oh! Get him! Wait, why are the flying mats not flying? You guys can fly, you know. That's why I brought you. You guys have wings, you know. So they don't fight for you and fly. Okay. Huh? I should probably crouch. No! No, no, dire wolf! Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm so nervous that they're gonna fall off the edge. I'm so scared. Okay. I need to get those spawners. I need you guys to not fall off the edge. Please. Oh, for great sake. No! No! No, no, no! Oh, I got it. You stinkies. Okay, we have to go around and get these spawners. Or these dudes... Oh, you... Yeah, that's what I thought. Let those thorns kick your butt. Is this world still on heart? Oh, yeah, I have it locked. How did that thorn... The thorns just kicked his butt. Oh, I see you. There we go. Oh, it's so much nicer that I can't accidentally hit them. I was so scared about them going over the edge though. Okay, we gotta get this one. Oh, excuse me. Wow, their follow is really close. Holy moly. Okay. Over here. Oh, there's so many of them. You guys are ridiculous. Stop it. I wish, oh gosh, I wish I could tell them all to like just stay there, but get him, get him. Oh, they're all starting to spawn in now. Wow, your follow is really close. Okay, I need to get that spawner. I need to get that spawner. And I'm worried if I fly that the animals are going to... No! 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 No, 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 no. Whoa. Oh my God, these animals. Man, I, it would be nice if I could like set a follow distance or something. Get him! You guys know you have wings, right? You have wings, use them. The whole freaking reason I brought flying mounts. Yeah, get him, dire wolf. Can't get that. Ow, ow, ow. Wait, where'd you go? I love how they bite you and then they run away like giant stink balls. This outside part's gonna be the complicated part, just getting these dang spawners. Look at the size of that dude. 
You are massive. I mean, no judgment here, man. Big is beautiful, but like, damn, you didn't even fit through those those Whoa. cave sounds. Oh, you giant sticky! Oh, can you guys move, please? Oh no! I need to get up there before they get me. I want to fly, but I know those animals are gonna follow me when I fly. No! Ugh. Why am I not? Uh, why am I not? Hello? Hopefully they'll be more useful inside. Okay. Are you done? Are you done? I am so scared they're gonna fall off that. Oh my God. <laughs> That's the most terrifying part about this. I see you up there. No, stop tech. Oh, we lost one. Well, I knew that was gonna happen at some point. Oh, jeez. Rip Sarp tech. Okay, I think we got all the spawners. Okay. Okay. Oh, I got on the mount. Do you guys fight when I'm here? On the mount? No? Oh, wait, what? There's a guardian? Oh, here we go. The floating is starting. The floating is starting. These guys, they are the worst. Yeah, see, see that message that's popping up about it being protected? That's exactly the most important thing. Oh, somehow I got on my mount and I don't know how. Did he like scoop me up? Wait, where's my dire wolf? Wait, why am I getting attacked? Wait, why is my cat attacking me? Or am I poisoned? I, I can't tell. Wait. The cat's attacking me! What? She's attacking me! Uh-oh. Or no, she's not. Maybe I was getting hit by something. Nope, she's attacking me! What is going on? Oh no, my, my, my kitty is attacking me. What do I do, what do I do, what do I do? Oh no, and we lost the, oh God, this is not good. This is not good, this is not good. This I can't have you, I can't have you attacking me too. Jesus. Why was she attacking me? That doesn't make any sense. Are you still mad at me? No. Oh, she's almost dead too though. Okay, no, we're gonna put you away. Okay. So yeah, all my other animals died really easily. So their health is really doo-doo. I'm really sad. Oh. I don't think I'm gonna do this with the animals. That's really sad. I really wanted to, but they're no match for these guys. Oh God, my armor. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. And there's charge creepers. Fast charge creepers! Oh my god, that was so speedy. Why were you so fast? Where'd he go? 
Where'd he go? Oh god, is he invisible? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Okay, that's... Oh, I can't turn the screeching down because I need to hear the other guys. Where'd the charge creeper go? So I guess I can't use my animals in this. Dang it. There must be more spawners that I'm missing. Ow! You're so strong, my poor gear! Why am I not getting XP from... Hello? I'm so confused! They're not dropping experience, which is uh, concerning, because I kind of need it. Hey, you guys see that? They're not dropping experience. Okay. We're just gonna have to- Ouch! Wait, I have mending on my gear, right? What is happening? God, you're annoying. Okay. Rats of the sky. There has to be another spawner that I've missed. Well, that one dropped experience. Oh God, look at their health. Okay, we need to get some of these spawners. Wait. Oh, I didn't, oh God, I thought I had end veil. No. Wait, where's my end veil? What is happening? I have freaking Envale on this. Oh, nope, nope, nope. What is going on? Why is Envale not on my gear? Pip! Hold on. Hold on. Okay, 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 okay. For whatever reason, Envale is not on my helmet? What is happening? This is just, this is just going so poorly. We lost our animals super quick. Please tell me I have Envale in here somewhere. Please, 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 please. I have an Envale trader somewhere, right? I think I do. I think I do. Oh my god, I had to stop another dungeon. <laughs> I like, I for whatever reason, that was so confusing. Why is the Enderman mad at me? Okay, hold on. Villager trade. I really want to go into the config file and turn up the animal's health because that's ridiculous. They were in netherite armor and they died that fast. Like that makes no sense to me. Okay, where's my Envale guy? Thank you. Why is there, oh my gosh, that was so confusing. Oh, nighttime rainbow again. Oh, pretty. Okay, helmet, you. You are such a stinky. Yeah, if I didn't have that on breaking, that would have been... Ooh, 30 levels, good gravy. Okay, now we have Envale. Holy, oh, maybe my thorns was hurting my animals or something. I don't know. Oh, or maybe my... I really hope that this stuff wasn't hurting and well, I don't want to use animals anymore, which sucks because I was really hoping to use them for this, but whatever. All right, um, and I don't I think we have a lot of bottles of enchanting, so yeah, we're really going to have to um, really going to have to play this kind of safe because uh, yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man, that sucks. Okay, aviary, 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 aviary. Okay, see that charge creeper over there? We're just gonna have to do this on our own. We really don't want to keep losing animals. It's so sad. Nope, you big bullies. Hopefully you guys can stop and like appreciate how beautiful this place is because I sure as heck can't because I have to worry about all the ah! 
Charge creepers! Quick, charge creepers! Why are you so fast? Oh, bananas. There has to be another spawner over here somewhere. I'm gonna lose my gear. <clears throat> oh my god. And my voice. I have to get rid of these spawners. I have to get rid of these spawners. These guys are zippy arrows. Yep. Bye. Or zippy, fly, uh, floaty. That's a word. Woo! Woo! Yeah, so these are the guys that messed me and hubby up when we were here before. They are brutal. I'm so sad that I can't use my animals because they're all just gonna die. Like, instantly. Oh, but I got them. I, I should probably use them. Maybe I'll use them more when I'm inside. Okay. There has to be more spawners in here. I think the most terrifying part is those ridiculously speedy creepers. Oh! Yep, 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 those ones. <sighs> oh my god, I'm getting rid of these bookshelves. Go away. I don't care about the loot. Why is my vein binding me? What is going on in this dungeon? Why are there phantoms in here? Charge creepers give me the, the heebie jeebies. Yes, make me float. Up, 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 up. Oh, spawners? Oh, there's a spawner up there, that's why. Oops, whoops, 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 whoops. Panic, panic, panic. Yes, keep making me float. Oh no, I got stuck. Yes, up here, up here. Oh god, the fish guys. Oh no. Those fish guys are the worst. Oh, no. Oh, 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 God. Oh, God. Oh. No. Get rid of this. Oh. Oh my god, there's so much happening right now! What is going on? There is so much happening right now. There is so much happening right now. I swore I got all of these phantom spawners. You guys just do stuff. So I don't know where all those baddies went. Oh, oh, I protect. Oh, oh my God, that, that, that mod protects my zombies. Oh, that's even better. Oh my God, I'm so happy. It protects my zombies too. Oh, that's so good. I'm so happy. So now I can't hurt my zombies. So it's not just pets and mounts, it's also zombies. Cool. Get him, zombies. I'm floating. I can't. 
Whew. This is nuts, my dudes. Let's break this. I don't have time to... Oh, got it. Oh, I don't have time to loot. Don't need the loot anyways. Oh, you do have fire. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I'm so glad I put keep inventory on. You have no idea. That place is insane. That place is insane. Oh, my God. This is this is nuts. This is absolutely nuts. Okay. All right. Okay. Um... Wow, this is going to be like a half an episode of me healing my gear. Holy cow. My poor gear is taking an absolute beating. Oh, I, th I swore I had more or, uh, potions of enchanting. Oh man, this is not good. I we've looted so many of them. I don't know where all of them went. Like I swore I had a ton of them. It makes me wonder if this config file got reset. Because we've looted so many bottles of enchanting. I wonder when I did the update if the config file got reset for the storage mod and if it's no longer 64. I'm going to go check that really quickly. Hold on. Okay, so nope, it is. We just don't have, uh, yeah. We just don't have a lot of bottles of enchanting, which kind of sucks because I'm going to need them for my gear. Oh man, this place is intense. This is, I think this is why hubby and I did it together because, or one of the reasons, because it, it's just, it's crazy to do on your own. So I'm going to do as much of it as I can, but if I lose this gear, like, I don't even know, do I have enough to, I don't have enough experience levels to make new stuff. Oh my God. Okay. So I guess, I guess we're going to go until I lose my gear. That's pretty much that's that's all I'm going to be able to do. I am going to just use all the animals that I can, though. I'm not going to use the birds, but I will use the dire wolves and stuff because they are in, uh, in the uh, the cats because they are ground mounts. So, uh, wait, I thought I had a totem on me. Oh, I guess when I died, I lost my totem of void on dying. Okay, well, I'm not worried about the void anymore. I'm going to keep the totem of undying on me. Um, these are going to be important. To, actually, I'll just have one on me there. Um, okay, so apparently these are important. These fire potions. Okay. The higher you get up, the more important they are. Okay, okay, okay. Um, we'll take out... Oh, God. We'll just get... We'll just get them out when we get there. I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm so underprepared for this. I thought I was prepared, but I, I forgot how absolutely insane this dungeon is. Okay. Okay. Whew. Oh, we got quests. Whoa. Wait, what did we just get? Oh. What's that? What's this void totem? In place grants creative flight in a seven by seven column. Whoa! I guess I should have checked the stuff that we got after we fought the other bosses. Huh. Okay. Well, those would be fun to tinker with in my own little time. Okay. Well, let's go back to the aviary. Let's get at our... Apparently laying down mounts. Uh, do I not have a stick? I got my inventory's in a mess right now. Okay. <clears throat> These guys are going to die really quickly, but whatever. At least we use them because I got this m the, the, the mod, so I might as well use them. Okay. Following. 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 All right. Oh, boy. All right, let's do this. No! Oh, my God. They almost pushed me off the edge. Stop it! <laughs> that would be one way to go out. Come on. Let's go get him. I really hope my cats don't attack me. I don't know why they attacked me before. Get him. Get 
I wonder if that's still making it so they still attack me. That's very weird. Well, that's keeping them busy, so. Oh, but if I move over here, it moves them. Uh-oh. No, you stinky. You get out of here. What? No! Well. There goes those cats. <laughs> Stupid creepers. <clears throat> and that's why, and I don't even know where the other two cats are. I have to turn down. I, I can't. That's so loud. I need to add like the, the pack from uh, Vanilla Tweaks that shuts up the phantoms. I'm just trying to zip through and get all these, get all these spawners. Nope. Yeah, you, you, you shoot him for me. Oh my god, these guys are the worst. These guys are the little, 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 little literal worst. No, I'm trying to get the spawner, you big stinky butts! Let me in your spawner! No! Oh god, I'm gonna die again. Oh no! This is so bad! <laughs> That's not what I meant to click! No! <laughs> I'm gonna die. Oh my god, this is so ridiculously brutal. Oh, I keep hitting my wings, but it's not working. God, this is painful. I'm gonna get out another totem. Oop, that's not a totem. That's a totem. Okay. Oh my God, they hit so hard. Guess I should pro blah, 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 blah. I should probably have a shield. Oh, for mother flipping poop sakes! Are you serious? Oh. That place is insane. <laughs> oh my god. That is insane! Are you serious? And my gear, oh my god. My poor gear. I don't have the I don't have the the brain cells for this today. I don't. This is oh my god. That one skeleton it killed me twice in netherite gear with all of this protection. Protection 8. <laughs> and Thorns, what is going on? Oh my god, this is insane. This is insane. I don't want to lose this gear. Like, I know this is the last episode, but like, it's, I've only been recording for like 45 minutes. I don't want to lose my gear already. What do we do? <laughs> I really don't want to go in that. I don't want to go back there. I lost all my animals. I'm going to get rid of these guys because I gave them to myself. Get rid of this. Oh, the animals did nothing against those guys. I was kind of hoping to see them fight a little bit longer, you know? Are these all? No. Nope. Gonna get rid of that one, that one. These are mine. That one. I mean, I lost the leads, but that's fine. That's all right. I don't care about that. Um, I kind of don't want to do that again. It, it, like, I'm not doing anything on my own. I'm not doing any good. It's just me dying over and over and over again. And that's not fun. That's not fun for the last episode. 
I got a guardian fish. That's not creepy. So now I'm just like stuck. What do I do? That was the plan for the episode. And I don't want to do the other one too because all of the end dungeons are exactly the same. The other flyer is going to be just as crazy. Man, what do we do? What do we do for the last episode? I really don't want to go back there. I am going to go heal my gear at the villagers though. And I keep going in there like I'm going to grab that. So let's do a little quickie, um, not really montage, but speed up of me going to trade with the villagers. Oh, I probably have planks. Do I have planks? Oh, okay, maybe I don't have planks. <laughs> We're in a good trade with the villagers, and uh, yeah. Uh, while I'm doing that, I'll think about what the heck I want to do. I think his voice sounded lower. Oh, and I keep forgetting I can just make the sticks. Why am I doing this? I could just do this. Yep, yep, that's my brain for you. All right, let's go over there and heal ourselves up. Gosh, dang. Yes, and I know I'm giving up, but like, that's not fun. That's not fun at all by yourself. Now I remember why I wanted Mr. Editor with me before, because that is not fun by myself. <laughs> I'm pouting over here because this sucks. <laughs> Oh, I hope you guys understand. All right, well, the, they need to reroll. So I'm going to stand here until they do and we'll come back. All right, they've rerolled. So the gear's still damaged, gonna trade with them, do another speedy trade because I think it sounds hilarious. And what we're actually gonna do is go fight the Void Blossom. I put a waste on there before and I guess we never got around to doing it, so we're gonna go do that because the Void Blossom is really cool and I want you guys to see what that one's all about. I'm not sure about doing the Lich, specifically because um, I think you have to like kill a bunch of zombies to make him spawn, at least that's what the videos that I've seen to find him, have, uh, that I've watched to try to find him have said, so. I don't know. I don't know about that, but we will go fight the Void Blossom and then we can make a decision after that. So let's repair the gear. All right, gear is repaired. Oh boy. Okay. Uh, oh, I put my waist on away. That's fine. Um, zombie, I guess we could recharge this just to have it. I don't think they're going to do anything against the Void Blossom. It's a... From what I've seen, it's kind of crazy, but I don't know. I could be mis under or mis misremembering, so... Oh my god, I'm so shaken up from that, that aviary. I know I gave up on it, but like you guys have to understand, that's not fun as a solo player. Like, not even in the slightest. That... Getting killed twice by one mob that quickly is just insane. And this gear too, it's just, nah, I can't do that. There, it's not fun for me, I'm sorry. I don't want the last episode to be me like being a grumpy butt. So I want to go have a little bit of fun and go and fight the Void Blossom. It's a, it's a shame the animal's health is so doo-doo, especially with, um, with netherite armor basically on because they had dragon armor on, so um, yeah. Hey, that sucks, but you know what? That's okay. Sometimes things don't work out, and that's all right because they, they, they don't work out. But we're gonna go fight the Void Blossom. I haven't done this boss before. I do know there's AoE on the ground, and I'm probably gonna have to look up and down and up and down and up and down, but that's okay. I want to try it. Um, it looks like a really cool boss, so let's go over there and try her out. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't want to spend our last episode with me being like, you know, sad because I'm losing animals and, you know. <laughs> All that stuff. Look at that thing. Look at it looking at me. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, we're starting. Okay, we're starting. We're starting. Okay. Okay. It was like, what? Are you staring at me? Why are you staring at me? And don't you know it's rude to stare? I guess the zombies can AoE for this. Oh, well, maybe not. Oh, there's so much stuff on the ground I can't see. Oh, there's so much stuff on the ground. Okay, there's a big one. There's a big one. Ow. Okay, 
Okay, okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh, walked into that one, okay. Oh, there's so much stuff on the grounds. I can't see anything from all these flowers. Ow, ow, ow. Ouch. Ouch, 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 ouch. I gotta get rid of all these flowers. Oh, it's gonna heal, isn't it? Like guessing where those things are popping up from by audio only. Ooh, sounds like your tummy's sore. All of this stuff is driving me bonkers. Oh, uh-oh. Oh boy. Oh boy. I don't like that. I don't like that. He's like, don't touch my flowers. I gotta take, I gotta take the, I gotta take the, I gotta take it. Oh, sword tummy. looking flower though oh these things are in my way okay so these are healing it okay gotta take the hit gotta take the hit gotta take the hit Gotta take the hit. Uh, excuse me? Okay. Nope, don't like that. Oh my god, that's my, that's my axe. Taking those hits. Woo! Come on. Woo! Let's go! Ooh, buddy. Where's the chest? Wasn't I supposed to get loot? Oh, I guess it just, uh, it went into my inventory. So crystal fruit grants brief regen and resistance, and there's the void thorn. Cool. That one was really, oh, one of the bramble things is still here. Wow, that, it's a really beautiful boss, too. Man, that was cool. In a hole. All right. Well, that was a void blossom. Okay, so I think we've done most of the bosses of mass destruction bosses, except for the lich, which I'm still like, I don't want to go and fight a bunch of zombies just to spawn the lich. 
But then other places that I've seen have been like, oh, you just go and find them with the the in the cold biomes with the um uh what are they called? Heart thing? Star? What is it called again? Hold on, let's see. Star. Yeah, these things. Soul stars. So I guess we can try that and see where that leads, but let, let me do a Google so we're not wandering around like dorks. Okay, so I'm not sure if it was on this world or if it was on medieval Minecraft where we found the Lich Tower while exploring. So let me just go home really quickly and just do a little bit of a, a scan over the map and see, because the tower is huge. It's in the cold biome and it's absolutely massive. So I don't even really need to use the star to find the Lich. Because I could just go to a cold, like it, mostly with the ice biomes from what I've seen in the pictures. Oh god, we did, we really didn't explore. Look at all these dots everywhere. My map really did not render properly. Okay, so I guess we can use the nature's compass and go and try, because I need to save some of these to activate the thing for the lich. So, um, let's try ice spikes. Yeah, let's try ice spikes. Let's do that first. I don't think, I, I keep hoping the zombies are gonna, I still haven't found the other saboteur either, which sucks, but. Um, strength, okay. This is so much more fun and more relaxed and like, it's still like, I, the fights are still intense, but it's nowhere near as crazy as uh, the aviary, which I really, really was hoping Mr. Editor would be able to join for that. So we're definitely going to have to be, um, getting a server up at some point so him and I can do that. Oh, what was I doing again? Oh yeah, rockets. Oh my gosh, my brain. Okay, so it says it is this way. So let's sleep first so we don't have phantoms spawning. Maybe that's another reason phantoms were spawning too. Who knows? I don't know. All oh, this pretty ponds. Oh gosh, that glitch. That's so terrible. And I had gotten a comment as well about talking or like showing my builds and everything. And the thing with time lapses and things like that is that they, they take a lot of time. Like. A lot of Minecrafters spend hours upon hours, like the full-time Minecrafters, the full-time like YouTube creators who do this as their full-time job. Like they they get they can do like eight, 10, 12 hour days sometimes and like all this, you know, stuff to edit and put into videos. But Mr. Editor also works full-time. So I'm not gonna send him 10 hour videos of me, you know, building and time-lapsing and stuff like that. So eventually I would like to show, but I don't really build like crazy builds. Like this is just cut into the side of a hill. It's got some stuff from the end. Um, if you guys, I explained the trees and everything and how to get them to grow like this and how to get the, the lilies to grow like this. I explained it in the video where I was showing this, but I'll, I'll explain it again here. Each of these trees grows on a specific type of end ground. So for me to have grown them here, I placed those pieces of end ground down in a, in a I think it was like a five by five and grew them, broke the end ground and then um, put the jelly uh, umbrella membrane underneath it. And then they stayed like that. For the lilies, you have to grow them on, uh, I think it's end soil, either end soil or end stone. I can't remember which one it was. And then you can break the stone out from underneath it and it keeps the flower, the flower doesn't break. So that's how I got these to do this. And then I filled it with water and and uh, have the the umbrella jelly under it. Just be very careful because if you break one of these umbrella jellies, the water's going everywhere. And I, I have had a, a few accidents where the water has sploshed all through my storage area and I've lost all my moss. So, or at least the moss pieces in the grass. So that's how I did this. It was honestly super easy. And this here is just, this was a hill. It just, a, I didn't even want to get rid of the whole hill. I just cut into the hill and just built this this section here. And it's it's kind of, evolved over time like it was stone before and i did a uh, cut soapstone or sorry polished soapstone surrounded it and the the trims for the inventory are all painted to match the the soapstone so it's really nothing special um i'm not a builder by any stretch of the imagination but i i, I just kind of do what comes to mind i guess um hopefully that explanation helped like you can see here it, it's like it's cut into the side so i actually added soapstone to kind of look like it was all of this was cut out and and you know just kind of i don't know i don't know how to describe it place there i don't know but yeah that's 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 what this is it's nothing special um and these were just 
you know, a normal house shape and I don't know I'm not a builder I don't know how to describe what I've done but uh yeah if you guys want more of an explanation I guess I can do a little side explanation but this is really I explained all of this in the video where I showed it off um I can't remember what episode number it was I'll, I'll get it popped up on the screen here I'll look for it uh, for when he does the edit but yeah so that is the that's all it is it's really nothing special but i really appreciate that you guys really enjoy the builds um but when i build i have hiccups oh my gosh when i build it's uh i'll build something and then i'll tear it all down because i didn't like it and then i'll redo it and then eventually over time it just morphs anyways because like i'm not happy with how it looked so it would be a whole cluster of me just yeah <laughs> A whole cluster of me being anxious and babbling about nonsense but yeah that's all it is this is really nothing special i love it though I, like, nothing special in the sense of it's not a grand build it just i used naturally growing things to add you know uh, special prettiness to it but yeah so that, that, that that's just my poorly poorly worded explanation as to how i did this <laughs> yeah that's all that is I, I like to instead of like building fresh things and building things from scratch i like to use the the nature that's around and like use the 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 spot not the spawn the generation that's around and kind of build into the generation because I, I i don't know it's more magical and mystical for my taste so yeah that's uh that's what this is and that's what i did with the the build so yeah but I appreciate you guys wanting to know how I did it. Um, hopefully I'll learn how to explain it a bit better because like I said at the beginning of the video, it's just like, this is a, a, a brand new thing for me. I mean, I did content creation in the past, but never, you know, video recording. And it's so much more comfortable for me. And this series was kind of a, um, like a stepping stone into learning what I do want to do and what I don't want to do for my future series. So yeah, it was kind of just a little, and not really mini series, but smaller than what my other series are gonna be for sure. But yeah, I appreciate the kind words about the builds. I appreciate you guys. I'm glad you like it. It's definitely uh, not where I wanted it to be, but yeah, I've learned. I've learned about what I do and do want to do and don't want to do. So yeah, let's go find the lich, um, and we will go fight him, and we will go have some fun with that and see how much more time we have left afterwards. All right, let's head over and find Mr. Lich. Oh, there's the flower temple that we found at the start. Oh, man. The memories. The double mushroom dungeon. When uh, the spawning of the dungeons was absolutely crazy when we started the series before they, they nerfed them. Look at all of these dungeons that spawned. So many. They love it. How far are we? 216. Okay, so this is what it looked like in the picture. Oh, oh. Apparently there's an ice thingy here. Okay, an icy temple. All right. Okay, okay. There was one that close to home. Cool, of course there was. There's a boat. That's not what we're looking for. So it's a giant... So I don't think this was the... Um, oh, a lighthouse. I don't think that this was the world that i came across it in i'm pretty sure it was medieval minecraft when i was exploring i um went i think i was in a video too where i was like oh what's that and like I, I i went by it so i think that's what that was in i don't think it was in this 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 series so um unfortunately we're gonna have to try to find him now we could use one star wait wait oh crap i didn't see where that went oh no Oh, I got it back. Okay. This... This way. This way? That way. It's so hard to see blue on blue. So it says it's this way. Oh no. Wait. Hold on. Oh, it's still that way. Okay. 
All right, I guess we follow the star. Let me just keep... The good thing about this, um, doing it this way is that you know it's going to be an icy biome, so you don't have to keep throwing it until you... Like, if it's pointing in this way, I know the direction is going to be until I hit an icy biome. Unlike, you know, with like a stronghold, which is buried underground. Maybe if we come across a griffin, I can tame one, actually tame one, and uh, use that to fly, because the game does not like it when I use rockets. But yeah, if you guys want to leave in the comments what your favorite part of the series was, I love reading your opinions and your thoughts and all that stuff. So let me know what you enjoyed the most and what you want to see again and things like that. And um, yeah, I'll definitely read them. I love talking to you guys in the comment section. Okay, so let's toss this again. I'm assuming it's still going to be this way. Yeah. Okay, so if that's the case, then let's get out our nature's compass and see. No, that's still pointing me to the other one. What about this one? No, that's pointing me that way. So this isn't even pointing me to where the star is. Okay. Okay. It's going to be nighttime soon, though, so let's have a little sleep. But yeah, like I was saying, I love seeing your guys' opinions and like what you think about the series and what your favorite stuff is. So let me know. while we stand here and wait for it to be dark enough to sleep. Do I have a waystone up that way? No. No, I don't. Normally I'll cut out this kind of stuff and like be like, okay, so I put a waystone down here and you know, we're gonna go do this, but I figured I'd chat while we go and find the boss together. Sleep. Go down, sun. I'm up, moon. So peaceful. Look at how beautiful that water is. Ugh, I love it. All right, let's toss another one of these. Well, I definitely don't break as easy, that's for sure. And I was wondering why we only had nine, but apparently they're very rare. So in the entire series, although I didn't have bosses of mass destruction in the pack up until probably midway through the series or something like that. So we probably would have had more, but um, I ended up taking it out when it was uh, like earlier in its beta. Because the Void Blossom would glitch and constantly show on my screen, like the, the tagline, or not the tagline, but the, the name tag. So we probably would have had more, but uh, I mean, even still having nine for how rare they supposedly are is, uh, is pretty good. We have killed a lot of zombies, though. I think it, if it's just zombies that drop it, I'm not sure. Zombies, skeletons, I'm not sure. Man, how far away is this? Oh, you see some snow. Alright, oh, that was just a little, little, uh, little bit of snow. Okay. Oh, Mr. Lich. <gasps> not my else. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, game did not like whatever that was. 
<gasps> Orcas! I never assume that, you know, you guys watch both series, so I'll say it here too. I love Orcas and the fact that they're in this pack and in Medieval Minecrafts. Oh man, I went on this whole tangent about it in Medieval Minecrafts about how beautiful they are, but I can't hover here like I can on the birds, so... Um... Yeah. They're so cute. Okay, let's land here. Oh, okay, so it's taking me this way now. I see some ice. Okay, are you gonna be around here? Let's see. Thinkies! <laughs> Okay, lots of ice, lots of ice. So going north, oh, there it is! Wow! Ouch. You have wings, Creo, use them. Whoa. Now that is a big tower. Very like World of Warcraft Lich King feels in that. Okay, so let's get ourselves situated here. I don't know what he does for his fighting, so... Um, I know I need these to activate something, it said. I can't remember what it was. Okay. I'm gonna put a waystone down, just in case I do die. Uh, waystone. Oh, it's so nice to be able to go up near ice and not have that weird lighting effect. Okay, so. Here we go. Oh, we got a soul star in there too, so we got ten. Okay. So I don't need that. Oh, I hear drowned. Oh, there's like drowned with like crowns on them. Interesting. Oh, this might melt and I might lose my waystone. Um, hold on. Hold on. Let's do this so we don't lose the waystone. All right, there's no... I keep forgetting what game I'm playing. I'm like, oh, st structural integrity. It's gonna, it's gonna collapse. No, that's not, that's not how this game works, Creo. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, okay, let's go. Let's go on over here with Mr. Lich. See what he wants to talk about. Ooh, I'm sliding. Oh man, this is so cool. Yes, I know, I just used a sword to break eyes. Don't judge me. <laughs> okay, so there's a big spawner up there. Why is my... Whoa. Hi. 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 Maybe I should have kept out the... The, uh... Whatchamahooza. Oh! Oh! There's a spawner down there. Oh, man. Oh, there's a downstairs. Oh, that's a big spawner. That looks like a big spawner. Maybe not. Oh, oh, oh. Hello, friends. Man, you guys seem like slicing through cake compared to the aviary. Holy cow. Okay, so I think I'm gonna need some blocks because, uh, yeah. This tower is a little wonky. Okay, so... Oh, I didn't... <laughs> of course I did! I need these. Is there a way up or do I just swim? I swim! 
Okay, there's a big goober up there. Whoa, Jesus, he scared me. Okay. Okay, so these are the pedestals. Okay, so I'm get what? <laughs> I'm gonna need to patch up the floor, I think. I, I really think I'm going to need to patch up the floor. Hey, friends. Okay, grab this, grab this. I guess my vein miner not working. There we go. Okay, we're just going to patch up the floor. I have a feeling that uh, he might have some boom booms or something and then the floor is going to give out and then I'm going to be in trouble. Oh, yeah. Okay. There we go. We're just going to, we're going to do a little pat, oh, for Pete's sake, we're going to do a little patchwork here. We're just gonna do a little quick cobblestone repair, you know, just just do this and this. If I could click properly, that might help. Where is this water coming from? Hello? There we go. Okay. Light that up. Light that up. And let's go up to... Is the big room? Patch up these holes here. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, these are slabs, that's why. Okay, let's get rid of these, because these are going to confuse me. And I'm going to have to sleep in a second. I'll just sleep in the throne room, or not throne room, but this room. All right. I'm guessing range is going to be good for this guy. Ooh, pretty. Oh, not so pretty. Hello? Whoa! That was so cool. Where is he? I'm gonna turn down um, hostile creatures because for whatever reason, phantoms are crazy loud. But it's gonna be hard to hear him. Where you at, bud? Hello? Oh, you're a big stinky, aren't you? Maybe I should have got a griffin. Um, hello? Hello? Oh, that's not fair! I can't even see where the heck he is! He's just floating around. There you are. Well, what the heck? How am I supposed to fight this guy? Where 
crazy. This is anticlimactic. Climactic? 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 Words? Hello? Am I supposed to be up there? Oh, 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 oh. I have my rockets in the wrong hands. How do people fly with the rockets when it's in like the off hand? I've never understood that. Where? Oh, wait. What? Um. Huh? Uh, I'm confused. What just happened? Hello? He's not on the thing anymore. I just flew around the tower and he disappeared. Man, do I gotta go spend time finding- Yep. <sighs> okay. Cool. Well, I'll bring you guys back when I find another one. Oh, good grief. This one was so far away. Okay. We're back in another lich room. This is- it's so confusing. Like, I don't understand what the dealio with him is. Maybe I'll break this ice here. And, like, break these pillars so I can get a better view of him. And he's flying around before we start this. And then uh, hopefully I'll have a better view of him. Because that was just really confusing. I looked it up and like I couldn't see anywhere where it said he despawns. So I, I don't know. I don't know what the dealio was with that. But we're going to do this again. And we're going to get to see that cool like thing that he does at the beginning. Oh, and the Aurora's out. Let's go. Oh, okay. It says he's over here. Okay. Oh, I forgot to get these ones out. Okay. Where are you at, Mr. Lich? Okay, thankfully that doesn't do any damage to the block. Zippy zoo. Okay, I can at least see him better in this one. Ooh! Okay. Uh, Phantom? Oh, he was. went invisible. Look at that. Oh, you're a big stinky. Very cool boss look. Like, oh my god, this guy is so cool looking. Hello? Oh, he teleported again. Where you at, bud? Mr. Lich, I just want to have a word with you. Hello? 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 Uh. 
Hello? Do I need to get rid of that phantom before he'll... Gosh, I hope he doesn't glitch. I only have two stars left. There is a phantom stuck somewhere. Where is that phantom stuck? Is he down below? Ow. Yes. How the heck do I get back up now? Oh god. Okay, I killed your phantom! Hello? And now his health bar is all the way back up. What is going on with this boss? I'm supremely confused. Is this boss just uber glitched or something? I refuse to believe that it- Oh! I heard him. Okay, he spawned a phantom. Oh, okay. Well, how did he heal? I'm so confused. He disappeared and then healed. What is going on? And then he disappears again. Does he like spawn these guys? I don't understand what's happening right now. I'm afraid to leave the tower because of what happened last time. And I like can't even hit him because he keeps going down below. But like if I go out there to try to fight him, he might reset. And he's invisible again. Man, I thought you were such a cool boss and now you're just being a goober buddy. Don't you heal. Oh my gosh, this is so annoying. He's such a cool looking boss, but like, good grief. Where are you at? Oh, stinky. Oh, that cool thing it, that, that Twirly does when he goes invisible is neat. Ooh, 
that one was a big one. God, you were such a stinky. Oh, I can't even hit him now. I'm doing so bad. This is gonna take a while. Holy moly. I think it's taking a while too because he's so like floaty. Okay, I hit him twice. Such a cool boss. I love when he opens his mouth like that. It's so neat. Where you at? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, you are. Oh my god, I'm so... Oh, if only I wasn't so bad with the bow. Oh my gosh. At least I stand some kind of a chance with this guy, unlike the aviary. Holy moly. Oh, he went invisible again. Hello? I cannot hit him. Oh my god, I, I am so bad. What is happening with me right now? Here we go. There's one. Hit him. Oh, god, this is gonna take a while. This is gonna take a while. Here we go. Here we go. Lead your shots, Creo. Lead your shots. Oh, you stinky. Come on. Where'd you go, bub? Oh, there's, there's so many phantoms below me. Woo, that one was hard. There's so many phantoms below me, but I don't want to go up or down because it either glitches him or he heals all the way. But there's so many phantoms. Hello? Oops. Hello? He's healing! No! Now I'm like panicking because it's so hard to hit him, but yet he's healing. Oh, don't like that. Whatever that is. so bad with a bow. I'm so concentrated on him, I'm not even hitting- <laughs> He just blew up his phantoms! Thanks for the help! Where'd he go? Where'd he go? No, he's healing again! No! That's not fair, I don't know where you are! No! That's not fair. You could barely get a glimpse of him and then he's freaking healing! 
No. You are such an uber stink. And I can't go downstairs to get those phantoms because if I do, he's going to reset. Oh my god, I hate this. I literally can't go down and get those phantoms. No! I hate this. I legitimately freaking hate this. Are they up? I'm so confused. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Oh, okay. Are they all stuck in the floor? He hasn't shown up either, so I have a feeling it has to do with these phantoms, but if I go down to get the phantoms, then it resets his health bar. At least it did in the last one. So I'm a little confused. Oh gosh, I don't know what to do. Um, maybe I'll put water there so I can get up quicker? I swear to God, if this resets his health bar, I'm going to be so mad. Okay, there they are. Dude, this is not a good time. Okay. I got his phantoms. Now what? He still hasn't fully healed. Am I supposed to go down and kill the rest of the zombies that are down there? Because all kinds of mobs are spawning around here right now. And I have a feeling that... Does that affect him? Like, I don't understand. I really want to put a magnum torch down to stop these natural spawns because it's just driving me bonkers. Something is not working here. What is happening? Oh, Mr. Lich. Where are you at? What is going on? I'm so confused what is happening! God, this has been such a cluster of an episode. Like, first I give up on the aviary and now I can't properly fight this lich. Um, it's probably something super obvious too. Hold on. 
Okay, so it says it won't go back into like once it drops past the one bar, it won't go back up into the next. However, he isn't respawning. So I'm going to put a magnum torch down. And stop natural spawns because this is ridiculous. And it says to fight him outside of the tower, which, I mean, I tried that, but it... It reset him last time, so I'm really nervous to go outside of the tower. Thanks for the, the night vision, dude. Oh! There he is! You big stinky! Is he trying to tell me to come outside and play? There he is. He's up there. <clears throat> It's not showing him on the map. So that's why I thought that he wasn't still around. He was here the whole time. It's just he wasn't showing up on the map. You giant stink. Okay. I need to get rid of these bars. There you are. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have put flame on my bow because he's an ice guy. So flame might have been... And it's too late now. Too late now, Creo. So we need to drop his health bar below the other diamonds. Going stinky. So I know if he disappears again, and I can't see him. Oh, and that's oh boy. Come on, I need to get you down below the other diamond. Come on. Ooh, 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 ooh. Lead your shots, Creo. Come on. There we go. Okay, so he won't heal past the middle bar now. Look at him flapping his arms around like a bird. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. I'm getting the hang of this now. Now that I'm not confused as to where the heck he went. My poor mouse is getting a workout here. Really good gear is actually doing good instead of getting clobbered by dudes in the aviary. Oh, you come back here. You come back here. You big stinky.
There we go. Okay, we got him below the other diamonds. Okay. All right, all right. Ouch, 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 ouch. Woo, that's a cool looking ability. Look at him flapping his arms. I'm a bird. Am I a bird? Am I a skeleton? I don't know. Oh, oh, oh. Where are you at, you big stink? Come here. Where are you? There you are. Oh, you are such a stink. Come here. Oh, he's healing. He's healing. Man, he's a cool boss. I can't believe I didn't think about putting flame on my bow, though. Because you know it would make sense. Oh, come on, he's almost dead. Come on. No! Come on, where are you, you big bully? Hello? No! He's not showing up on the map anymore! Oh no, I don't know where he is. And I'm so scared, I don't want him to reset. There he is. Nice midair shot. Okay. Oh god, these stupid pillars. Which is the literal worst. Wait, where'd he go? Ouch. Oh, come on, he's so close. Yes! Let's go! That was so much fun! I mean, a little frustrating at first because I couldn't figure out where he went, but that was so much fun! Oh, no. My bags are full. Okay, I got the ancient thing. Okay. Wow, that was so cool, though. He really is a cool-looking boss. Like, honestly. Really, really cool-looking boss. Well done. He was a lot of fun to fight. Minus the fact that I couldn't find him for a couple minutes there, but... Wow! Really, really cool fight. Well, that was definitely a... A nice spot to end the the last episode. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on, let me, let me, let me get in here. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, the lag! Whoa! That was scary. Okay. Oh, bananas. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for watching the last episode in this series. I just want to say a huge, huge, huge thank you for all of the support over the, the last 23 episodes. It's meant the absolute world to me. And of course, I would love to hear your input and your favorite moments from the, the series, even your, your least favorite moments and things you would like to see improved or things you'd like to see in the next series. And please go vote on the community tab poll so I know. Uh, if you would like to see Prominence or FTB Skies or leave more suggestions in the comments there. And I will see you guys in the next series. Goodbye!